the one question which always I find it fascinating in cancer biology is that how can we eliminate tumors permanently? So we know chemotherapy in brain tumor uh, treatment is working, but it's only working for a very short time period. And all, eventually all tumor patients relapse. And what we can clearly see that is really the stem cells are important and that's crucial cells and are the seed for the tumor to come back after chemotherapy. The progenitor cells, the fast dividing cells, the differentiated cells, they respond to chemotherapy and they are gone. But the stem cells are you know, basically untouched. So they don't care about the chemotherapy. And they, if you withdraw the therapy, you see these cells start to divide and they give rise to the other cells again. The tumor bulk is basically rebuilt. I mean, now if we have a model system, so we can really zoom into the tumor. So we can use the genetic engineering trick to really put individual different colors, we call it fluorescent proteins, into different populations of the cells. The cells I described, for example, they are stem cells, non-stem cells, and uh, stroma cells. Now you can label each cell population into different colors. We will be able to generalize all the parameters from this tumor, and then basically get to know all the features of the different cells. And then in the end, you will be able to know so what is the most dangerous cell? What is the cancer stem cell there? Where are they? This is a way to identify therapeutic target in these cells for the next steps.